Hi, everyone. We're broadcasting from Slim and Mame Stadium, home of the Terra Bay Mutineers. A lot of Mutineer fans enjoying some good tailgate fun out in the parking lot. Yeah, but it's not a tailgate. They got planks, and they're making the other team's fans walk off into a shark tank. Like I said, good old fun in the parking lot. Let's play some mutant football. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Carolina Panthers battle. The Terror Bay Mutineers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. Uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. Offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> First down and forever. Hot. Hot one. And that pass is good for about five yards. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the defense was ready for that bombs away dirty trick that time. Third down and forever. Hot one. And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Hey, what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? And they line up for the extra point. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And 
It's first and ten. on that play, Briggs. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that'll be second down and four. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. Second down in a mile. Oh, good run. He nearly broke it open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly blew three times the legal limit last night leaving the stadium. And I nearly did not get arrested, get thrown face first into a paddy wagon, get taken for a rough ride. And I nearly did not have prison set. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. for two points. <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's
yards, first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. a sonic blast, dirty trick, and throws a supersonic miss. And like Rix's bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. First down. I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Second down and nine. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Caught for the first down. First down and one. Look out, that's an all-out attack. Now, if he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, kiss kiss say, what the fuck the fuck the fuck? <laughs> First down and one. through for a touchdown and the defense called the thunderclap dirty trick man that's gotta hurt don't make the hair on your corpse stand straight up <laughs> don't try to get fancy here just put the ball down and kick it in that order Grim? you gotta be kidding me my sister could have made that kick isn't your sister in a wheelchair i know right Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. Second and three. <laughs> and that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And the crowd goes wild! Touchdown! Touchdown! Yeah, yeah. Yeah, baby. I'm the greatest. No, 
tell you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. And he misses that extra point. Oh, well, look at clown shoes down there. Is he wearing actual clown shoes? I think so. It's probably why he missed. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. run before he stopped. Second down and two. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. The defense calls timeout. They must be trying to get on their QB's good side. Third and two. that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners. And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. He's a midnight smoker. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. The quarterback freaked the ball to explode, and the defensive player got blown to bits. <laughs> Second down and ten. Are they desperate, or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And Will Katz will give him a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first. 
first and ten. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. And he throws that one to the sidelines. <laughs> Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, NFL isn't a... And it's a miss. Looks like the QB had some issues with the ball placement. Spikes out. Spikes out. How many times do you have to tell that idiot QB to hold the ball with the spikes out? of speed he finds an opening and the first down and that's the end of the second quarter someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers stay with us for the halftime show brought to you by our friends at monsatan industries we make genetically altered franken food you'll have fun trying to identify we are back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff the coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. Ruin it. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. First and ten. The defense called a one speed dirty trick. Man, look at him go. And he's off to the races. If you get one more bullshit penalty, you get one more for free. You also probably lose the game. Yeah. Just do the attack ref dirty trick. They're back up here on first, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref.
Well, that's a lovely shake for the punter today. He just put his team in the hole. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. Catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Second down and two. Caught for the first down. First and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Functioning brain cells before that hit. They're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. You can't keep a good mute. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Wow, the quarterback just threw a sonic blast back, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And that'll bring up third and one. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. First and four. Oh, and the defense jumps outside and attacks the QB. And look at the QB run for his life. He's so fast. Nah, I just found out about that cheerleader's pregnancy test. I'd run too. Yeah. She's huge. Yeah. First and two. Second down and two. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Uh, normally, I don't advocate for changing the station, but for the sake of your eternal soul, I'd understand if you want to cut away during this ritualistic dance. Uh, Rim? The, uh, the crowd started chanting. Why, uh, yes, uh, <laughs> yes, they did. We're... We're going to go ahead and lock the announcer's booth until he's done dancing. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't wrong. It might have been a chick wearing a wig. First and ten. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Second down and ten. Oh, the defense must have called a hot potato dirty trick. Well, and the offense. 
offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this outfit. Third down, and the punter is warming up. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. He's not going down. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we off, Grim? Aren't we off? Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. You have got to be kidding me. My sister could have made that kick. <laughs> Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. <laughs> They'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a. Uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. First and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Well, they should be needing chip shot extra point, but. You never know with kickers. <laughs> Man, this guy couldn't hit the side of a fallout shelter. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. He had it for a second there. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. They 
they're going for. Offense calls their first timeout. Oh, thank God. I've been sitting on this burrito for the last two hours. I gotta go. Yeah, thanks, Bricks. Really appreciate that transparency. I'll mention it. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now and is gonna try and score. Oh, he just got crushed. First and ten. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! And it's first and ten. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, did we hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. this week the ref calls a penalty you know the mfl has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties stupid jerks you guys suck third down and long He should have had that one. Oh, well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I picture it that day. Uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. The return man catches the ball and hits a field. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. That's a TR pass play, and that's not going to get it done. The offense needs to move the ball upfield. Pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. Third and two. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. The defense has the receivers covered well. That's a three yard gain on that pass. Second down and seven. Freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and five. Defense holds him to a four-yard pick up there. And that'll bring up third and one. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 90.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Wow. Well. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. The receiver just got smashed. Not as bad as me last night. He may be dead, but trust me, he's in better shape than I am right now. Oh, geez, here it comes. Blah. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. <laughs> and 
And here comes the extra point attempt. And then, my friends, is why the world hates kickers. I kind of feel sorry for him. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Only two minutes left in the game. And it's first and ten. He picks up five on that play. A timeout is called by the defense to stop the clock. They have one remaining. Second down and five. Stop. This is intense. No, Gwen. Camping is intense. <laughs> Get it? Idiot. And it's first and ten. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And that'll be second and eight to go. Just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Third and four. And a hard run there picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. The Terra Bay Mutineers pillage the opposition and win today's game. After a stomping like that, the opposition may be a permanent part of the field. More like a graveyard, Grim. There are body parts everywhere. And speaking of body parts, that I have a tell well, you Let's listen to the MVP. I'm sure he has something inspiring to say. Hey, okay. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.